today I'm gonna just. Oh my gosh, okay. Media at the moment. Goodness. I'm trying to record that I got hiccups. Oh my gosh, so much has happened. Hopefully, those hiccups are gone. And my dogs are just jingling all over the place. But today is about focusing on what I really want to be doing. So I'm going to just listen to myself and give myself a break. Because I, I created this list the other day. And it was about what I wanted to be as a person. And I quickly realized I'm a huge doer. I am always doing stuff. And if I ever take a moment of peace and a break, I spiral down, but eventually I'll settle and then I'll recharge and then I can hit the ground running again. But getting to that part is very done hard. some dishes and I'm working on laundry at the moment. I'll still be doing normal chores, but at the same time, I'm just going to relax. I'm going to play this game and... Uh, you guys are going to be here chilling with me. It's not going to be a long video, by the way. Like, But then it is me, so I don't know. I, I really can't tell you. But welcome to a relaxing day. guys when you work in social media it's super fun so fun I love it but it also can be taxing on your mental emotional and sometimes physical state and let's say you're not getting a lot of likes follows views and it's a number of days that that has lined up I struggle with that because it makes me question my value it's like oh what am I doing wrong and um why can't I be better why am I not getting these views that I really want and it's just a whole spiral down and I caught myself doing that the other day so I took the day off played Dreamlight Valley all day it was awesome didn't look at my phone no social media as soon as I noticed I automatically pull it up like Instagram I'm always pulling it up and when I did that, I kept like, I was like, nope, we're not looking at anything. No updates, don't wanna see notifications, don't wanna see anything. It was very freeing to take this break. And I'm gonna try and do that more. I've created a boundary with myself. I do this for fun. And as soon as I start treating it like a job, the fun gets sucked out. And I don't want that to happen. And I wanna be happy and healthy and give good content, yes, but also be honest and real, which honesty is policy, always been my thing. But anyway, long story short, turn short, what I wrote yesterday was just so good. So I just want to share it with you, just so you could have it in the back of your head for yourself. I can do anything because not only am I capable, I am already enough, and I know I am valuable and will live as such even if no one else sees it. I do. <laughs> You're just relaxing. 
I wanted to share that with you guys because I know that we go throughout our days and sometimes we don't feel noticed and cared about and we feel like the outcast. And you're not, you're not. People are living their own lives or in their own heads. When you feel as that outcast, take that time to embrace it because it can be such a growing experience for you where you can learn to be happy by yourself. Anyway, thank you for coming to my motivational self-talk. <laughs> now that I'm done journaling, I am gonna play this game. I am excited. I am ready. <sighs> I was debating on playing a 24 hour game through and I never do that unless I really, really like a game. And I really, really like this game, so. <laughs> who knows, who knows. Rest is important though. So I chose rest myself. I chose my health over the game, which is good. I was so tempted not to, but I made the right choice, I believe. I know, I know I did. Please <laughs> look at my character. I think she's so pretty in her dress. Oh my goodness, the princess vibes, I'm about it. Good news, just checked on the laundry. It was damp, had to run it again. That's the best. Couldn't film anything while I walked the dogs. That was just not possible. You know, it's just a little me having to walk a big dog and a medium sized dog. It just doesn't work out that well. So, give myself some lean cuisine, the vermin, vermin, Vermont, vermin, um, the Vermont white cheddar cheese, mac and cheese. I'm excited. Oh, do you have hiccups too? Oh, little baby girl. Little baby girl, look at you. Oh, are you so happy? Oh, let's go get that food. We're back. Hi. Hi, Miss Drooly. Hi, Miss Drooly. No. No. <laughs> You're so good. You're a refined gentleman. If you can see it, her tail. Her tail is like a whip. When she gets excited, it just slaps you. Yeah. You're so cute. You're so cute. My hair is so crazy right now, but you know what? It is what it is. My face and hair have hated me over the last few weeks because of how much makeup and product I've been putting in it. And, you know, straightening my hair is never kind to curls so taking these few days off have been very very nice very helpful i feel very relaxed i'm just enjoying the day i'm just doing what i really want to do wow it's been pretty nice gotta admit i needed this yeah i'm naturally a doer so if i'm not doing stuff i go insane so the fact that I can just enjoy this time right now is not bad. Not bad at all. Guys, I'm going to be honest. It's just going to be this for the rest of the night. Like my husband's going to come home. I'll make dinner. We'll probably watch Breaking Bad. And then I'll just play this again. Like that's all I'm going to do today. And I'm loving it. Well, of course, walk, walk my dogs. Get a little exercise for all of us as a family. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed watching this today. I hope you got to relax. I mean, if you haven't relaxed in, if you haven't relaxed in a while, try to find time, even an hour. An hour a day can make a difference. I used to take an hour a day to take a bath when I was working a lot. I used to pull 60 hour weeks. <laughs> don't miss it. I don't miss it at all. If you have the opportunity to take an hour, 30 minutes, or 15 minutes, whatever you can for yourself to breathe, do it. You are worth the time to take a break. It is a-okay. Well guys, it's the end of the vlog. Thanks for watching and on to the next one. Here we go.